as with all of these, we get sucked into the diagram. It's, um, but it's worth reading the text at the top. The command word here is label, and um, we need to label the features indicated by the arrows on the injection molding machine below. There are five boxes and five marks, so we don't need to write too much. This should be relatively simple um, if you know your injection molding process. I'm going to start on the top left and work our way clockwise. It doesn't really matter which way we go, um, but we can see that the first item is the mold. Um, and it's worth calling this either a split mold or as you can see here, it's a two part mold. Um, it's not enough just to put mold and be careful with your spelling of the word of, of mold. Um, sometimes I see M-O-L-D. Make sure there's a U in there. The next thing is the heater. It's not particularly obvious in this in this diagram, but the heater, you know that it has to be at that state that section of the injection molding machine. Then we have the hopper into which go the granules. Um, and again, it's worth just clarifying that we're going to be putting in a thermopolymer here. Um, we know that um, thermopolymers tend to be the ones that are injection molded, although you can occasionally use thermosets, but this, it's a difficult thing to do that. And then bottom left, we've got the cavity. Now, as you can see, the granules in this particular machine are only halfway along, so, we, so it isn't actually molded yet. But you might want to say that this is where the molded shape would be. But cavity is probably the correct term for this section. Now, that's not all that's on the diagram. There's only five marks and you've got them all, but it's just worth pointing out the rest of the diagram just in case it comes up in the in the exam. Um, don't forget, you've got the Archimedean screw in the middle. You've got a motor and a hydraulic ram. Um, other questions that relate to injection molding might include a description of the process, and that's probably going to be an 11 or a 12 marker. Um, but this is a relatively simple question um, where you just need to put in these key parts of the injection molding machine.